Hello everyone, Mauro here. In this lesson, we're going to look at steps to download the Windows 11 version 24H2 ISO file. If you want to download the official ISO file to create a bootable media, launch the setup from the desktop to perform an in-place upgrade, or you want to keep an offline copy of the new version, you can download the Windows 11 ISO file directly from Microsoft. Okay, let's dive into the steps. But before, please subscribe to the channel and click the like button to help YouTube show this video to more people. It doesn't cost anything and you will be helping the channel and supporting my work. First, open your preferred web browser and then go to this website and then scroll down and under download Windows 11 disk image ISO for x64 devices, select Windows 11 and then click the download button. Then select the product language, in my case English, and then click the confirm button. And from here, you can just click the 64 bit download button to save the ISO file for version 24H2 on your computer. Now, if this option isn't working, you can also use the media creation tool. And to do that, you can open the same website and then under create windows 11 installation media just click the download button and save that file to your computer then just go to the folder where you downloaded the file and then right click and select the open option here click accept and then if you need to change the language you can uncheck this option and from here, you can change the setting, then click Next. And in here, you can choose the ISO file option and then click Next. Confirm where you want to save the file and click the Save button. Now, the media creation tool is going to download the files and it's going to proceed to create that ISO file. After downloading the uh, installation files, the tool is going to create the Windows 11 media. After the process has been completed, the media creation tool is going to tell you where the ISO file has been saved, and then you can just click the Finish button. And that's it. Those are two quick ways that you can download the ISO files directly from Microsoft without having to use third-party tools. Remember to like the video, leave your comments, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet, and I just hope this video was informative for you, and I would like to thank you for viewing.